Alright, what's up guys and welcome back to Stranded Deep. Now we're going to co uh, continue with our island. Right, what was I planning to do next? I can't remember. Well, you've got a few things, right? You could either make the uh, the mountain itself look more rocky and mountainous yes. and add some trees. Or you could, in your shoreline thing, that middle bit right there, you could probably add some rocks on the sides to make it look like it's not just a, a, death, sl a death slope. Yeah, so first of all I get to making the mountain look a bit more rocky. Okay, so you're gonna make it so you'd have to go around the island to yeah, get to yeah. the other side. Make it hard, you know? Yeah, it's not just like a straight shot from one place to another. So we have a little sort of shelter there, which is pretty cool. You've got think. a cave, you've got a shelter, you've got a cliff, yeah. a bit of a mountain, and it's looking good. It is. A few beaches. Let's make uh, the rest of this island now more rocky. Here we go. That's the start of our path. Okay. I didn't know you were going to make a rock path. I don't even know if that's possible, is it? Well, I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm sure it is. That's gonna be a horrible thing. I know, because they're, gonna gonna they're gonna fall down. <laughs> yeah. That's harsh. <laughs> there we go. There's two yucca trees up there. Two's enough, I think. Yeah, yeah. And let's make it more interesting by putting a snake down. Why would you do this? Eh? Why would you do this? Make it a challenge. Harsh, man. Oh, snake. Defend. There we go. There's a snake right there. I mean, I think I need to add another rock there. Oh, no, it'll be a jump. It'll be a jump. Yeah. <laughs> you want yucca? You jump. Right. So let's just sort of make this all rocky. I mean, there's got to be a reason why you don't see this kind of stuff in the game. Yeah. It might, it might be to do with the fact that the game lags so much when you're doing it. Or we can't handle it, but it's, this isn't a big island, so we will try and yeah. see. But it's not a big island, you know. Right, let's let's make this even more interesting and put some stone here. Oh uh, yeah, like you're ever gonna get that clay? I mean, it's a challenge, right? Mm. Well, Gotta make your way. You like your challenges? <laughs> you have any idea how rock mad you've gone? Oh, I think it's okay. I mean, it's looking good. I got a feeling the game ain't gonna want to load it. <laughs> <laughs> Well, the game has no choice. It has to. Ah, oh, nice. Oh, I'd love to get up there. So we've got a little bit of a place where somebody could build a base if they'd wish up there. Um, oh, what else can we put in? Structures. Let's let's get some there, uh, put in some shipwrecks and stuff. We'll have another little rowboat to show that they tried getting out but they died. <laughs> <laughs> wow! I mean, you got to get into the. Here's the rowboat. They tried to escape and they died. And then they sunk to the bottom of the thing and left loads of treasure for us so players to collect. I they obviously didn't get very far, did they? I think people appreciate that. There we well, go. that they died. No, that the robots under the water. <laughs> yeah. Right there we go. So we need to go on objects. Uh, let's grab this bad boy.
Oh, I like that. What do you think, Noodle? Is that stuck enough in the rock, dude? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's sick. Yeah, that's definitely stuck. It's, it's like a diving platform. It is a diving platform. For anybody that thinks they can dive down into the water to get to these shipwrecks quicker or something, or to leave the island quicker. I mean, yeah, you, Ooh. Could, you could just get your raft out there. But yeah, but it's no fun like that, is it? Give people the option to dive. But then see what we're going to do, Noodle, is well, if we go down here, it's patrolled by great white sharks. So that means that you will die. I mean, what's the incentive of jumping off this thing? It makes people laugh. <laughs> incentive number one. You might die. Incentive yeah. number two. If you don't die, the sharks will kill you. I mean, they can get to both shipwrecks, and there's awesome treasure in there, guys, if you ever decide to use this. <laughs> wow. Do it, and then comment back how poorly you failed. There we go. That ain't little. So it's right, uh, pretty it's big. A teeny tiny one. Maybe go for another one of these. To entice people into the water more, like you have to go in there, <laughs> and you, you will die. Right, okay, so, any ideas for anything else, Noodle? <laughs> no. Right, I do. I actually have a very, very good idea. People that are playing are going to be like, Oh, I so need that bit as my island. And then I'll be like, yeah, we'll go get it. You know what I'm saying? You don't know what I'm saying, because I'm nope. not making any sense, am I? I ain't got a clue. Nice one. I thought you fudged up. No, I had a plan. Basically. Now, who wouldn't want to settle on that bit of land? Me. Right nice, straight, flat surface where you can build a big base. Oh, there's going to be a challenge to get over there. Well, no, definitely me. I, I just go in the cave. Oh, I see. I mean, so there's one way you can try and run and jump upwards, or you can try and land on this little bit there, or you can try and land on there, <laughs> or you can go into the water, it's up to you, totally up to you. <laughs> I choose sharks. But yeah, this is the land of opportunity, you can build a nice fort up here guys, so I suggest, if you use it, to go for this place, I really do suggest, I will make it easy for you too, to get to your base, gotta make it slightly appealing, you know. I think it's quite functionable. Uh, no, no, it looks nice though. Why isn't it functionable? Functionable? Yeah. <laughs> functional. Fun, 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 functionable. <laughs> I love it. So why? Explain, <laughs> Noodle. Well, if you look at all the other stuff that the rest of the game gives you, right? You'd come here for a bit of fun, and then and then you'd leave. Yeah, but that's people who just don't want to take the challenge of actually trying to survive on an island. I mean, like yeah, if you, isn't if it? If you wanted to, you could build quite the epic base here. Yeah, you can make it look really nice, provided you're given the resources. Yeah, you're gonna chop down that tree; it's gonna fall right into the water. <laughs> you are a horrible, horrible. Well, man. you've got to work for it. You are a horrible. I'm not man. just gonna give you free trees. <laughs> Trees are scarce in Stranded Deep. If you no, want to not. make sure that they always fall into the water when you chop them down, because if you chop them from the other direction, you can get them falling onto the land. Yeah. Just just lean the trees a bit towards the water. <laughs> so it doesn't <laughs> matter where you cut it from. Now who's mean? <laughs> right, this is where you can come and get coconuts, and from my experience, when you climb trees, you never fall out of them. No, no, it's perfectly safe. So, yeah. Even when it's stormy. No, you do fall out of them, because I've done it a million times. Even when it's sunny. <laughs> Ok, 
coming in the way. It's looking nice. Right, we're going to leave you here for today, guys. So far, so good. We've done a lot to the island. Got some shipwrecks. Made it sort of impossible for people to have a good time on this island. <laughs> but yeah, I if like you all it. enjoyed, then hit the like button and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Peace.